It is time for one of the most appreciated and kind of sought after things that they do around here at the Resource Center, and that is the Estate Planning Workshop. And it's coming up soon. Wendy's with yes. me today to tell me all about it. I'm not kidding. This is really popular here. It is. It's very popular. Mm -hmm. um, we Our classes fill up monthly, and we have added two dates in June. And so we have some workshops coming up again where we're going to be discussing the basics. Right. And this is the basics. First of all, you do have types of estate plans. It's Absolutely. not just one thing covers all. No. It's, it's not a one-size-fits-all mm -hmm. plan at all. Um, we have, there's different types of estate plans, power of attorney right um, where you can make legal decisions financial moves health care directives those are very important when you are caring for a loved one who has become incapacitated right mm -hmm. um, also the last will and testament um, a lot of people don't realize this that um, this is directions and instructions for a probate judge um, it is public in the probate court. Mm -hmm. It is not a private matter. Um, unlike, you know, you see in the movies, the reading of the will. Yes, um, yeah. that's Hollywood stuff. That's Hollywood, of. exactly. Yeah. <laughs> and so we give, a, that, that's an option, but we also have options that are private, which right. would be the trust planning. Right, well, that's, I, I mean, there are different ways to prepare for, you know, like my passing. Right. There's different ways to prepare that. And that's why you have this all for the probate judge. Everything gets black and white, and it's not as long and drawn out of a process. Right, but and it is public, and, it, and it's costly, mm -hmm. yes. too. Oh, yeah. So um, your family you know, is paying a portion to the probate court. Of course. So if somebody wants something that's more private, um, they would do a trust plan. Mm -hmm. And so where there's various types of trusts, so many different ones, um, we, that's kind of what we talk about, our specific ones that work best for each family. Sure, and that tends to leave the questions out. Everything is Absolutely. in black and white. It's easily settled, and you said, you know, you have various options, but settled privately. Privately. It's not all part of public record at It's that not point. public at all. Mm -hmm. And there's, you know, typically no fighting. Everything's been set out um, the way mom and dad, let's say, you know, yeah. wanted things to go. Yeah, yeah. And then I, I, I know Bruce and I have talked many times about it. Yes. And there are so many reasons to do this because it helps prevent a lot of trips and falls, so to speak, yes. when you're going through these things. Absolutely. Planning, it definitely pays off. Mm -hmm. You you know, one reason people plan is because they want their kids or their heirs to um, love each other after they're gone and still get along. Yes. You don't have the, the inter-family kind of fighting because this is it. Mm -hmm. This is the way it's set. Yeah, lengthy or expensive probate courts. The health care direct is very important. That's very, very important. Yes. You're, you know, um, they've already made the decision of what to do. You're mm -hmm. just following their d instructions. You're not put in a predicament where you're having to decide right. how to care for this person. Exactly. And of course, that last part, that's what we were talking about. It settles all of that sort of thing. There are other things, I believe, the other things that can help plan to prevent. Is that right? Yes, there are. And just real quick, on the yep. family feuds, we see it's the things and the stuff that people fight over, sometimes more than, you know, like you would see property. It's the That's stuff. It's the sentimental stuff. It is. Right. And so, yeah, definitely a good reason to plan. Mm -hmm. And there you are, of course, having assets taken away by the healthcare system. Yes. Want to prevent that. Absolutely. And there's ways to prevent that. And that is something that we also discussed at the workshop, ways to prevent giving up your hard-earned assets and just handing it over. Mm -hmm. And of course, the last one there, your heirs protected from taking that big tax bite. That's which right. Which you want to be able to help them avoid. Absolutely shelter as much as we can. And so that's also another thing that we discuss. All right, very good. Now, people want to sign up, they yep. want more information. I know you've got the Give phone the number call. there, yes. 11th and 12th. Yes. Six and two, and you, you notice that 
that hyphenated word there. No cost. Yes. That's no probably cost. the best part. Yes, it's great. It's it's just informational. It lasts about an hour and 15 minutes. And um, I think you'll leave um, with a lot of good information that you didn't have before. There you are. And all those reasons. That's why it's one of the most popular services that the Resource Center yes. has to offer. Wendy, thank you. Thank you. Back to you.